animal care training. They don't really do much of this. What else could they do that would be useful? Because they really are kind of a useless person at this moment. Unless maybe I make them, um, maybe I've been thinking of starting glass making. I think time is now. They're going to be our glass maker. Even though they'd be really good in our military, they will be our glass maker. Animal care and hunter. We do so much more things too. Lie making, butchery. I don't see hunting be a major thing, but let's take a little bit off of your plate. Let's see. Okay, this section. Gelding. Uh, cool. I'm not going to tell anyone to geld anytime soon. I don't have that issue on my hand. I actually have doctors, which is crazy. I need to start setting up that hospital. Chips and powder is going to become a... Yeah, all's well that ends well. I, <laughs> I don't... Uh, they, okay, they want to do that? Cool. My farming is... Pit. What don't you do? Brewing? We have a lot of brewers, though. Why are, are you... Really? My brewers are terrible. I really need to get that up. Let's just give ourselves one brewer. We don't need so many. And we don't need so many pressers. I don't even press. Wow. These migrants really make optimizing work a little bit more tricky. We don't need two lie makers. I see all my dwarves to do all the haul. I set all my dwarves to do all the hauling, but it's better to separate that. How do you go about the hauling labor? So, Arma, right now, I definitely am um, just letting them all, excuse me, all do the hauling. But, however, I really do think later on that it makes sense when you're getting like over a hundred different and you're seeing those idle numbers creep up, is literally make dedicated haulers. Anyone who's a craft dwarf, they're not going to do the hauling. Make sure other dwarves are hauling. But that's like a luxury you get once your port hits a certain size. Oh, you disable wood and stone? Yeah, that's a great idea too. That just means that they focus on their task at hand. In fact, I think that's maybe a really good first one. Because you do have enough luxury to do that. So, I will need to in the game, disable their hall. No, I can do it right here. They're just not going to... Do I really want to do that? No. I think some things I'll want to haul. What is that? What things don't I want them to haul? Stone. That's one thing. That would be the most annoying thing for them to haul all the time. Stone. And I think I agree. Stone and wood are pretty much the two things that I wouldn't want them to have anything to do with. Or trade. Or furniture. Burial, yes. Animal cleaning, yeah. Construction. Yeah, sure. That'll be useful. Okay. I like that. That was a great idea. Thank you, Jeb, for that. Yeah, so it's kind of going to be like a, for the most part, from, I would say, like, it's a dynamic change that occurs throughout the game. As you get bigger, you can dedicate more people to hauling and uh, take away hauling from others. Um, the miners are just going to show such an uh, amazing return right off the bat. I wasn't even thinking about the fact that they're always busy hauling the stone that they've been mining. That really slows down everything they're doing. Okay, so we got dyers who I'm not dying anything. One is the plant process. Literally this person oh, is a miner. Well, they're gonna just stay a miner. Okay, we got a weaver and a spinner. So we're going to take... What are you doing? Are you going to be a new... Zest? 
Tech is going to be our new, a new commander. It's the only, we need to make a new militia. We have too many people. Great, great squad. A captain of the guard. Okay. Do we have a captain of the guard? No. Uh, let's do a, do we need a captain of the guard? Yeah, probably. That'd be good. Let's find Zass. Potash Maker. You are now captain of the guard, Zass. Welcome. So let's create that squad. Let's make them metal armor. Cool. Now we actually have. I know that Thor Therapist is up, guys. I'm still using it a lot. What? What's that? Sal for two. Walkie. I don't know. What, what does that mean exactly? When do you use that? I am not familiar with that emoji. Okay. So, we have people... Let's refresh this again. I, don't, I know I refreshed it, but... We have people we can give over to the army. For the betterment. Is, are they good? Oh, they are good in the army. Okay. Go. Welcome to the Wires of Righteousness. It sells key emoji with some cool sunglasses. What's uh oh. oh okay, I had to look really close. My um chat I need to get like a, a dedicated screen to chat. I kinda wanna place it like right up here. That way, it will look like I'm looking at you guys when I talk and I read it. So, I have a tablet that I'm not using that I might try to create a Twitch, like, chat, like, thing on it. I am interested in emojis, Arma. Um, I want to... Um, I'm currently looking for someone to create me some. So I'm in the market for uh, to commission someone. I need three right now, but I think it'd be best if I got five. Um, and then I can uh, start getting them out. I was going to try to find someone to do it today. Uh, but maybe, I don't know how I'll do it. I'll have to think about it. But I definitely want the emojis. What are you, what are you doing? You're a sword dwarf? Well, welcome to the Wires of Righteousness. Look at this, things are coming together. Which one? Book finding. Wow. No, you're not going anywhere. You're staying here. I'm a butcher, Mark Scorp. Welcome. To the wires. I think you need to submit three different sizes for their emojis. I don't think it's a um one size fits all kind of thing unless it's a vector and then i guess that you'd want it at the any size and it could resize itself um i don't know uh i've only spent like 13 seconds looking into it um curb has spent more time looking into it but seriously if you know someone that is looking for like a commission and makes some dope art like, it doesn't need to even be emoji, but if they're willing to try emojis, I'm all for it. Like, and I'm all for, like, someone, I don't know. I, I'm good for experimental. I just want it to be awesome. And that's a pretty nebulous statement to make, I realize. It's like, I just need the best emojis. Make, make the emojis great again. 
No, make make me some great emojis. Just straight. I don't have any. There's no way that there's no way that they can be bad yet. If I don't even if I lack them right off the bat, I don't have a weaver. Well, that can't. That won't do. Let's let's make the weaver the shearer for now, because we don't even have industry, and we don't even have a cloth maker. Make the thinner the clothes. Maybe I can make them go back and forth. I right, hopefully. Unless can I spread this out a little bit? A little bit of love. Oh, you're the farmer. Oh, we don't want to overload them. Don't want to overload the farmer. Yeah, this is what we're do for now. And then we'll need just to make ourselves a cloth maker at a different time. When we get there. Found it. The best Twitch emote sizes are 28 by 28 for web, 56 for 6, 56 for a retina display, and 112 for and 112 for larger platform. That's odd sizes. That is. And yeah, so those are the three that you need to submit for the I'm guessing that you submit three for the different types of platform. Oh, I got a, a nice message. Give me one. Oh, very sweet. Oh, so everyone, exciting times. I got my ice cream maker last night. Uh, so this weekend, my plan is to try to make ice cream from scratch. So I'm going to share something on the Discord channel. Uh, show my how that turns out how much I butcher it but I'm excited I don't know what kind of ice cream I'm going to make but it will probably turn out pretty terrible uh, we should just get these people lined up one brewer, two cook well we really don't need two cook we honestly probably need another brewer before we yeah we're we're make the farmer our brewer again we got to we need cheese maker no longer is there plant processing what the dear lord oh he's our miner too shoot that's right that's why i took him off can't can't be doing this task You now are doing this task. Come on. Um, can be good to put some time into finding a good person that you like the style of them. You're going to commission to make animated gifts, but I haven't done work for a long time. If I feel like it, is it okay if I drop in? Yeah, please do. That would be great. Is it good enough for you? Yeah, vector images are very useful for these types of things. It's all calculated and always gives the best chart. The fit for everything. Working with rasterized images are easier, but vectors aren't too bad. Just takes some time to get used to. Still new to vectoring. Oh, I bet you know. This is my say for uh, my saying for everything. I actually have a picture of it, but it the picture says. Actually, I'm just gonna take it down for you guys. Sucking at something is the first step at get sort of get uh, at getting sort of good at something. It, it's wise words, and I hang it up on my wall just to realize that I'm going to mess up perpetually. But I'll get better with time. More on the animation side of things, like After Effects. After Effects is really <laughs> yeah, I love it too. Looks more professional since it's vectors. Uh. I got that, um, it's an interesting story how I got that. I, um, I was living in Cleveland, Ohio, 
and my job was whatever it was, and I was going through a hard time, through a through a pretty harsh breakup at that time, and there was this cafe called Phoenix Cafe I would go to all the time. I really liked it. And one day, I was at Phoenix, and I got to know the manager, and they had this that sign up. And I just talked to them, and I was like, hey, I really love it. And apparently, there's like, we have these old school print presses. We have all these old school other, like, um, like we have these talks that go on and there's all these like series of like communicate, um, like work cooperation going on. So like this speaker spoke at this like city hall kind of thing. And then this print press took some of the best quotes from it and printed out these motivational posters and then distributed it to all like the cafes and places, caterings that help throughout. And the manager just was like, hey, you're moving. I heard you're going to New York. Take this as a gift. And he gave it to me. And so that was kind of my, I'm out of here. Later. Gift. It was really nice. Are they good for military? No, they should stay our farmer. I think that we figured, figured most of this out. Do we have any loosey-goosey people? We do. They will go, and what are you doing? You're not loose, then. That doesn't count. What? What are you doing, Jeff? You had a task. Oh. You're t apparently, you were in the military, and you fell out. You're back in the military, Jeb. We fixed it. Don't worry. And you're in the military. You're in the military. You're in the military. All the military. Wow. We got up to almost two full militias through this. That's great. Dang hide again. <laughs> Off to fight another war. Okay. Let me... Need to increase the barracks then. Because that was... Wasn't part of the plan quite yet, but now that it is, we need to give you a place to train. In sleep. The military barrack. Mm, that will annoy me if I do that. How's all the digging going? That's going. People are working. The aqueduct is coming together. Maybe. Yeah. Almost there. Sure, I don't care about if it looks good anymore. I just want to get this filthy thing done. Waiting. Waiting. Well, I'm
What can I do with this? No. I was thinking of putting the animals in here. That would be fun. Just around them. But I'll have to think on that. I want... I was going to put the outside animals there. Not the inside animals. But we'll have to figure out... I want to kind of dig a trench and give them a place to be. So I need to find a good trench spot. I think I found one. It will be right underneath the aqueduct. I think let's let's mark it. We'll do something like maybe right there. Yeah, like that. It'll be a small little trench. We can grow some outside plants right there, potentially. Uh, we can have some animals if we make it a little bit larger. That'd be great. I still didn't make the stockpiles for bones and stuff. Let's get that squared away. Bones, shells, teeth, horns, and hooves. Back stop. Do I really need to make a quantum of uh, this kind of stuff? No. Am I going to? Definitely. Hey, Righteous. How's it going? Afternoon. It's still my morning, but afternoon. That is my arch enemy. We meet again, Mr. Mossy. What? I would never be your arch enemy. Unless it's one of those, like, arch enemy friendship things, and then I'm, I'm cool with that. As long as there's the friendship component to it. It'd be like Xavier and, um... Uh, Magneto kind of thing, right? Because we could go for that. I'm up for that kind of relationship. We'll always have mercy for each other. We just differ in our thoughts. How's it going, buddy? Secretly. <laughs> I'm a bot. What are you talking about? Beep, boop, boop. How could I beat anyone? That must have Elven Caravan. Why? I am ready for you this time. I am ready for you, but we also need to hit the switch. So we had an interesting stuff going on today. Um, we got invaded by goblins, and then they just walked by and were like, Ciao, see you later, and did nothing. They are like, we don't, we don't care anymore. And I was like, okay. So all we can trade these people are our cut gems. But we have plenty of cut gems. Cut gems for days. Been keeping my gem cutter busy. Um, I don't think, oh, we have mugs. Let's see what kind of mugs we got going on. We have way too many mugs, in fact. I'm going to just trade to three piles. Let's request this trader. Make sure we actually have a broker. Dragoman is our broker. Good, good. Hey, you. They were low-key lovers, Magneto and Pro. They were low-key lovers. It, it was a great little bromance that was going on. Ah, my washing machine. Ah, I thought that was some of the best bits of the X-Men were their relationship and how you could take two strong stances in opposite directions but have the same kind of meaning and outcome. 
Granted, Magneto had given up on humanity while Carl still had faith in humanity, but I'm not sure he was right in that. I tend to default to have faith. Stock level's low on biscuits. Uh oh. Um, what's our plant? Oh, our drink's low too. Do we have barrels? Do I need to screw up some jugs? Oh, you suspended for some reason. Let's queue up some jugs. Not jugs. Let me let me see what I actually need. I'm going to go to the craft. I'll see it. Like pot maybe? Yeah, I need a pot. Lots of pots. We're just gonna put repeat pot for a while. <laughs> Make sure that we can keep our brewing going in case we're out of wood. Which we're not out of wood. What what's going on here? Oh, you suspend why did you suspend that? Maybe the workshop is saying that we're good. Uh the workflow. That would explain it. How's this going? It's going pretty well. Do we got some beds in place? We do. Nice. Hmm. So how's the how's the the machine learning writing going, righteous? You're getting it refined, or have you finished it and moved on to your next project? A farmer guild hall, finally. They've been asking for it. They've been demanding it, in fact. I'm gonna decide, okay, fine, fine, fine. Give you what you want. If you really need it that badly. Oh, this is great. It just worked out perfectly. Couldn't have gone further if I wanted to. We probably should put some religion stuff. Maybe this will be religion and guild lane for now. Ah. 